What's up, A family? It's Common Sense Investor coming at you with another video. And look, just like it's important for me to come and tell y'all when I'm wrong, I feel good when I can come and tell y'all that I'm right. And how I figure it out by putting the dots together. And I got an email from somebody, and I'm going to share that screen with y'all and let y'all see this email that confirmed exactly what I was saying. I said, the blood in the water that everybody's smelling is from the small hedgies and the brokers. That's their bloods in the water and the sharks are smelling it and they're coming. BlackRock and Vanguard and the rest of these son bitches, they're loading the boat on AMC. And I told y'all I know why. They're the ones behind this shit. I told y'all it's planned, it's in a program, it's been running, and its purpose is the MOAS, and that's because that's what BlackRock and Vanguard want. They've loaded the boat so that when the MOAS happens, those billions of dollars of, that belong to the little hedges now belong to them. So it's been a power thing. The United States government, everybody's involved in the bullshit. But something major has happened. Russia decides it wants to invade Ukraine. And in doing so, it has fucked up the entire financial markets. Now, it's not the little hedgy blood that's in the water. I said it was BlackRock and Vanguard's blood in the water. And everybody's smelling their blood. So, to prove my point, I'm going to share my screen and watch this shit. I got an email here from Louie. And Louie says, ACSI, I hope this email finds you well. When you have a chance, watch this vid. No wonder Vanguard, Goldman, BlackRock reduced their positions. Holy crap. Take care. Louie. So I clicked on it. And there's the video. I'm in the middle of watching it now. Oops. Move it here. All right. So where was I? Okay, right here. Now watch this. When I check the screenshot out, it says the top asset managers with Russian exposure. Okay, coming from Morningstar Data and Rutgers. But top managers, top asset managers with Russian exposure. Vanguard around 7.8 billion. BlackRock 264 million, but around 5 billion when included iShares ETFs. Fidelity has a Russian exposure of 4.49 billion. All right. Goldman Sachs. 1.72 billion. Fidelity Series Emerging Markets Opportunity Fund, 1.67 billion. Okay. So 1.67 billion, 1.645, a $6 billion exposed. Over here, Investco. <laughs> Vanguard Total International Stock Fund, another 3.5 billion. Vanguard, another one for 3 billion. I mean, it just goes on and on. I told y'all, when Russia attacked, that cut BlackRock and Vanguard and Goldman Sachs and the ones that's been running this shit, it cut them. You get out of stop sharing. It cut them. It put their blood in the fucking water. People are wondering now what the fuck is about to happen because it was supposed to be a simple thing and it was supposed to carry on, but they have to hurry now. Why? Because they need the money. They've been exposed. Uh, their billions. I just showed y'all from that email, billions of dollars. You say, oh, but they control trillions. I don't give a fuck. A rich man don't want to lose a dime. So they're going to push the fucking squeeze up. I believe it's got to be happening real soon to cover BlackRock and Vanguard's ass. They need little hedges money. Talk to y'all later. I love y'all and be blessed.